All right, guys, what's going on? So we're looking at today is uh, Monday, 10, uh, 10, 26. It's been crazy, cra crazy, crazy week. Been so busy, uh, new job, everything like that. So it's been hard to get some videos up, trying to get back into things. So today what I'm gonna do, so I got a little secret for you guys, but I'm gonna uh, show you, I'm gonna do my best to show you what my food looks like the day and a little bit of prep. I'm gonna ask my boss today, it's a new job, I'm gonna ask my boss today if I can film you know, at least my meals at work real quick, kind of pop up in the video. So, uh, I will show you guys what I'm having first and what I usually do for my morning routine and breakfast. I woke up this morning, did my cardio. I wake up, I have a glass of water in a cup, and then I'll do a one squeeze lemon, uh, my normal fat burners for the cardio, and then I am good to go and I'll drink water throughout my cardio, and that's that's my morning routine. Now onto like my first meal, my vitamins, my minerals, you know, my super shake that I usually do, whatever you want to call it, and I'll show you guys that. All right, be right back. Oh, here we go. So our first first meal is we're gonna do we're gonna do ten ounces of egg whites right now. We're gonna throw that in the cup, um, fry it up. Usually I'll do spinach for breakfast. We have I don't I ran out of spinach, so I'm gonna do like a little bit of asparagus in with my egg whites, and then we also do one tablespoon of mac nut oil uh, in there by Species Nutrition. Very big on this. I went to a seminar uh, with Dave with my buddy Justin uh, and Dave Palumbo about uh, a few weeks ago, and um, just basically explaining the benefits over mac nut oil, over like a coconut oil. Um, and over the other types of oil, you're gonna get more benefits out of a macro oil with all the omegas in there and the different uh, types of omegas rather than a coconut oil where it's more more so uh, MCT. Um, an easy way to explain that um, is an MCT is basically burned a little bit quicker for fuel. So I can you can almost correlate it to it's like basically you're having white rice to like a, like a brown rice. One's gonna absorb a little bit faster. They do have different benefits. Um, I would say the uh, I would say mackerel oil is a little bit healthier and a little bit better for burning fat, um, especially when you're this deep into contest prep. So we have that. So I'm going to show you. So basically, we're going to toss we're going to toss a tablespoon of this in there, some asparagus, and we have our egg whites cooking up. So that's that's our breakfast, and then I will show you. Oh, focus, and then I will show you what else uh, we have for the morning. So this is also what I've been, uh, I'll have been i be using. We have some garlic powder, onion powder, and Himalayan pink salt. I'm just going to toss that in here. As you can see, I got the asparagus, poured the egg whites in there. It doesn't take very long to cook. I'm going to toss that in there. Um, still keeping sodium in, obviously. Always sodium. Sodium has no, um, no correlation to like fat loss so basically it has nothing to do with 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 fat loss so you can add in sodium people don't be afraid to add in I mean don't add in crazy amounts but especially when you're really really low carb or no carb sodium is is, is a huge electrolyte it's gonna help with your workout so if you're no carb and you're still having shitty workouts up your sodium because you may not be having enough to the light okay so now we have my shake going on just cooked the breakfast you guys saw that so basically what we're doing right here. So we're gonna start off with one scoop of raw cacao super blend. So basically this is some fiber in there. It's a detoxifier. Uh, it's curb your appetite. I mean just tons of it's just tons, just tons of nutrients um, in here as well. It's not gonna really add any extra calories that you know that it's that I need to worry about. So zero net carbs, zero sugar, just basically overall healthy. You know what I mean? So we got that, we put one, one scoop of that in there. Then we're gonna do a tablespoon to two tablespoons of colloidal minerals, great for hydration. Just making sure I'm getting everything I need in there. Then we're gonna do one scoop of Res Vital Greens. This is the one I had, very good one. Um, and then we'll do a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar in there as well. As far as supplement wise, oh I'm sorry, we're also gonna throw in scoop of fiber lies in there which is unbelievable. Species nutrition, awesome. Um, you're looking for soluble fiber in this. Okay. Oh. Wow, focus. Anyway, you're looking for soluble fiber in here. So that's what this has. So this is an awesome shake in the morning. I always do that. And then as far as vitamins go, this is what I've been taking. Um, 
yeah, it's, I mean, it's all species, to be honest with you, but uh, I, I stand behind their products. Um, I have for years. I've used a lot of their products for years. Um, I just recently purchased their whole line um, because I was at the studio, and I was like, I can get everything here instead of shipping it. Mineralize, which is your multivitamin. It's a chelate version, too. All capsule form. Your body really absorbs these, which is unbelievable, so I really like this. Arthralize, joint support. This dose is really freaking high. They throw extra um, collagen in there too. A lot of pills, but again, I mean, you're looking at 2,000 megs of glucosamine, 2,000 of chondroitin, I mean, um, of MSM. You have shark cartilage in here. You, I mean, you got a bunch. Omegalize, which is your blend, three, six, and nine. They have high in threes. Big thing in this is palmiolith, palmiolytic acid, omega-7, Huge for fat loss, guys. Huge for fat loss. No one ever puts that in their product. It's so expensive. Lipolyze, which is there. Basically, they're non-stim caffeine-free. You have acetyl L-carnitine. You have green tea in there. You got you have alpha lipoic. A lot of natural ingredients to help pretty much stimulate um, fat, um, fat burning without the crazy jitters. And then I have an ultimate floor of fifty billion, which I keep in the fridge. So that's my morning. All right. Everything, guys, and that's all set. Peace. Okay, guys, what's going on? So I'm just about to head into work. We're gonna have meal two right now. Uh, basically, what we're gonna be having is we're gonna be having a shake right now. Um, we're doing isolize. Uh, we're gonna do the chocolate it's peanut butter one, a scoop and a half. We're looking at about like 35, 40 grams of protein. Uh, really good source of protein. This one, very, 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 very clean. Uh, so this is my meal number two, and then I'll show you guys what else I am having later. Peace. By the way. What's up, YouTube? So, here at work, it's about a couple hours after uh, the shake in my car. Been at work for a few hours now, so we're having meal three. We have three more meals for today. Performance nutrition and Seekonk, by the way, guys. And uh, we have five ounces of tilapia with, usually I'll have uh, like asparagus. Uh, they ran out of asparagus at the grocery store, so we have the, just uh, the frozen kale. And then we have some buffalo sauce on there. Uh, so this is our third meal for the day. And uh, yeah, it's going pretty well today. Uh, works pretty busy, which is nice, and keep my mind off things. So we're going to go ahead and devour this. And that's it. So it is possible. If you're at work, you can do this, guys. It is. Catch you guys next meal. Probably be having the same thing. Peace. All right, we're looking at a few hours later. We have meal number four here. Same as meal number three. Meals, I mean, the meals aren't really that different through prep. I, most of you guys know it's, it's pretty basic, especially as they get down to the end. There's really not, like, much to them. So again, this meal, we got no carb, we have five ounces of tilapia, and then we have, again, we have um, some spinach and stuff, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, kale, that we throw in here, throw some hot sauce on it, that's meal number four, we have one more meal pre-training, uh, about, and I want to say around 7.30ish, I usually probably do my, my pre-workout meal about an hour before, uh, hour and a half, gives it time to digest, so I'm not like... It's like all full, but I mean the like I said like the meals are pretty small, so it's not it's not like my I'm like full before my workout, so I I can literally eat it like a half an hour before and I'd be good. So we got meal number four, so it can be done. So working a full time job, prepping, it can be done. You just gotta prepare for it. Uh, like today, you know, I had the frozen um, frozen steamable vegetables, you know, which is just they're just frozen vegetables. You pop them in the microwave. You know, if you don't have time to cook that. It's not really an excuse. Same thing with fish. Fish and stuff like that. It's so easy to cook. That's not really an excuse. So, <clears throat> you know, for work, what a lot of times I do is people ask, you know, I can't really take breaks. So, what I always tell people is, all right, well, make a deal with your boss. Say, you know, I won't take a break, but literally it takes me like two minutes to eat these meals. So, don't take a break and just stuff down your meals real quick and kind of just work then at that point. Um, that's what I always do. So I'm going to devour this and then go back to work. Talk to you. What's up, what's up? 
Alright, so we got our fifth meal of the day here. Uh, we're looking at our pre-workout meal. So today, something new that I'm trying out. Uh, well, not I'm trying out, but coach is trying uh, for me. So we're having five ounces. This is a pre-workout, five ounces of steak. And we're having a tablespoon of macro oil as our pre. Uh, we're going to about a wait, say, I want to say about a half an hour, 45 minutes by the time we get out of here. And about a half an hour to the gym. This is our pre-workout, and then we have one more meal. So this is meal five, and then meal six is going to be our post. And we're done for the day. So as you can see, so what we're looking at, I'm not going to do any veggies this one. Um, just because I don't want it to sit in my stomach too long because this is already heavy to digest. So I'm going to put some, the classic, red hot wing sauce on it. And this is going down. Training back today. I'll talk to you guys later after my workout. <clears throat> Show you guys my post-workout meal. Peace.